John. Two wins out of two at the start of the season, two hard fought wins. You must be pleased with the start that you've made. Yeah, pleased with the wins, certainly. You know, it's, it's very much about, about being consistent, it's about playing well, it's about executing well, it's about a new team really that's trying to come together and, and, and play extremely well and pick up the points at the end of the at the end of the day. And two out of two, it's a great start. Um, going into the season, you're hoping to get a good start, you know, um, come push middle eight because two wins is vital. We expected two tough games anyway. Um, especially the game against Halifax first came out, uh, you know, both teams bidding for top four. Um, put a good performance in it, came out on top and then uh, another tough win in awful conditions really against a tough Oldham team. I didn't, uh, I didn't feature in that game but uh, I did come to watch and I watched the boys, they got a really tough win. Oldham were no, were no uh, pushovers, they came and they really gave it to the boys and I thought, um, I suppose in them conditions all that matters is that we got the win and we did so that's the most important thing. How disappointed have you been to miss out on it last week? Yeah, I mean, I got an injury against Leeds. Um, I missed the first two games, you know, um, I haven't proper made my debut yet, so uh, hopefully this week is selected, I'll be, I'll uh, enjoy, enjoy it. I played at the Mount quite a few times um, in my career, and it's not, a, it's not a pleasant place to go sometimes. I can only imagine their pitching, you know, it's not in great condition, down the slope. Um, it's all, again, I think it's a case of who will land all the conditions better. Um, and another, again, it's going to be another four-point game for us because you know we win that, and that's a four-point game on uh, one of the potential top four teams. We've achieved the goals that we set out, and it gives us an opportunity now. We're, we're coming up against the Batley team, who we played really well last week, so we know we're in with a really tough challenge. We're going to have to uh, really be on our A game to take their boys on. I know that they've got some big fellas in middle who like to roll down the hill, and they know how to use it effectively. So. Um, you know, it's all. It's not only just a, a game of rugby league. It's also a uh, play the hill as well as the game. So I'm sure we'll, we'll take that into account when we go into the game. But our focus is just to uh, to make sure we all perform well and make sure that we get the win on Sunday. It's, it's a great place to go play. You know, it's tough. Uh, it's one of the games what you like to play in, uh, especially down at their ground and that pitch. Uh, it's uh, going to be a dogfight, and uh, yeah, I'll, I'll love to play in that. You know, we expect it to be difficult. But... We cut up games against a team that's beat Halifax in the end convincingly, so they've got to be a decent team. Uh, big challenge for us. Um, hopefully the weather's a little bit better, but if it's not, then we'll handle that as well. It's, you know, it's the signings that we've made this year have been really good, and they've all added value um, to what we already had last year. Um, identifying areas, of the, you know, areas of the game where we might need to improve, and I think that's shown through so far. Not just. Uh, in the last two uh, league games, but also the friendlies, uh, beating you know opposition like Wakefield and you know having a good game against Leeds. Um, so it's being able to win these tough games, you know, that, that what could have potentially let us down last year, like Oldham away, we lost that game last year, uh, Sheffield away, and if we can grind out these victories, um, you know, it'll put us in good stead for you know maybe pushing on to either first or second. We've won there last year, uh, we know how to play against them and they'll be a different proposition this year. Obviously a new coach sets a, a new set of standards, a new set of goals and a, and a different way of playing so we'll have to adapt to that but at the moment we're happy with what we're doing. Um, we, we think we're playing okay uh, without getting comf you know, carried away and overconfident. We think that um, we'll need to be as good as we possibly can be as well to win. There will be a tough challenge on Sunday at Batley. Uh, obviously, a slow, but difficult slope to play on as well. You're looking forward to the challenge? Yeah, like I say, it's a forward battle like that. Uh, great in middle. You know, it'll be a tough battle against a, a big set and a good battle side. There's been a lot of hard work done. Uh, we trained four nights, you know, four nights a week um, in pre-season this year compared to the three we did last year. Um, so it's nice to see that all the hard work that we've put in over the winter months, you know, it's paying off and coming out in performances. Um, yeah, I'm just, I've just come to do what I, I enjoy doing and that's play rugby and I'm enjoying my rugby again here and yeah, I'm just enjoying it. Benny, I feel like I've been playing really well at the moment. Obviously, I've been mostly playing at Leeds in the pre-season friendlies and um, I've managed to pick up a bit of game time in, in pre-season. Uh, and it was also nice to feature against St. Ellen's at round one for Leeds. It were, it were a good experience and it's an eye-opener of what's, what there is to uh, achieve this season for me. I feel like 
if I just keep my head down and keep working hard and keep playing the best that I can, then fingers crossed there'll be more opportunity for me um, at least. But uh, at the moment, I'm focused on playing at Fev. I love playing for Fev, and I really want to do my jersey proud. So um, hopefully the crowd can get there at Batley this weekend and really, um, really get behind us, me and the boys.